Hey, my lovely little pack. I am back with another video. Today, I had a different video plan, but I didn't get enough stories to uh, to do it. Um, anyways, um, but I got another video I'm doing today. So remember to like and subscribe to my channel. Follow me, and then hit that notification bell. Soon, I'm gonna start any of my videos. Roll the intro. cooking video today um so i've already got the corn going right now um they're boiling as usual and we got the chicken right here and i'm gonna make this a five star chicken and some corn i was chewing on gum so yeah also i posted a couple pictures on facebook uh about my gothic selfies and this Facebook group called Goth Boys and uh, they denied me because I had my knife and they're like please take the knife away from your face and I'm like please grow a pair no one give a shit <laughs> should have said that but I don't know who the admin is and I'm literally even if I get kicked out by saying that there's still like 50 other goth fucking groups I can join <laughs> that's not gonna bother me So I have the corn almost done. I should have timed it better. So yeah. I wasn't cooking it in the microwave by the way, I was defrosting it. Okay, so I'm just gonna turn on the other thing. There we go. Now remember, I made some mistakes before, but never put that too high. What you're gonna do is you're going to slowly decrease the fire. See, right like that. Because when you have it too high, it'll burn the outside and not cook the inside. So, yeah. So, let's uh, add the shit. So, I'm going to start off with some salt. Well, actually, what I want to do is move that and we're going to get ourselves a knife. We might need it. Ah, here we go. Okay. We got our knife. I'm gonna take this and cut off this part. Ah, hold on, I gotta put this down for a second. Alright, so just our knife. I'm going to take some salt, add it on there, some pepper, and of course, can't live without some of this shit, it's good. And after you got your rosemary, you're going to want to flip it, start over. Salt, pepper. Rosemary. Now you want to see if your other pan is done. See if your pan's heated up enough. Okay, it's heated. To heat up, if you're not sure if your pan's hot or not, what you want to do is splash some water and flick the pan. Start over. Salt. Pepper, rosemary, flip, salt, pepper, rosemary, put it on here. There you go. Now, we're going to need a spoon. 
So get your spoon. I would go with a big spoon. And now, take some butter. Uh, I prefer this brand of butter, which I will show you in a second. Put the butter on there. Just so add a little bit more butter, just to make sure it stays. You always gotta have butter. Because the butter keeps it from dehyd or getting dry. This is the brand of butter I use. But any butter I suppose will work. A little bit of this shit. Some cooking wine. It's purple. Or red or whatever you want to call it. I'm just going to put a little bit of this in there. That'll work. Now we're going to take this. And it's too small. Okay, so I'm going to take a pizza tray. I can get ready. I'm gonna take a pizza pan, put it on top of it. It is pretty much the only thing I have to put on top of it. So I'm gonna let that cook. And I'm gonna pick up the, I'm gonna keep the butter out, but the um, cooking wine we can leave. We can put it back in the fridge. By the way, you guys, uh, if y'all used cooking wine before, where do you put yours? Like, I always put mine in the fridge. Tell me in the comments where y'all put yours if you use it. Okay. So I'm back. Uh, let's see. This is almost, the corn's almost done. But I'm going to keep it going for a few more minutes. Because I want to time it until that one's done. So yeah, uh. Now, I'm going to take this plate and clean it. I have a shit ton of dishes in the sink anyway. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Now I'm going to put up the spices since we no longer need them. These go in here. This, the top of them. this, yeah. Now you want to keep your butter out because you might need a little more. Might. Now you don't want the chicken dry, so that's why we use butter. And the cookie wine is just for extra flavor. So, uh, now all you pretty much need, you got your plate, spatula. Now all you need, spatula, knife, and plate. Pretty much all you need now, other than the butter. I still have my butter spoon right here, by the way. Yeah, so let's take a little look, see. It looks good, already starting to cook. I'm just gonna check one more time to see my flame is okay. So, well, that is cooking for about a few minutes. I'm going to be right back. Bye. This time, she wasn't right, like, oh my go god, some of this over here, the smoke gun up. So yeah, we're going back. I needed this season. Oh my god. <laughs> I forgot to turn off the corn and all the water is just straight up evaporated. Don't do that, guys. Alright, so now we're going to get this blue thing. See what I mean? See? Ooh. We have the... Oh, here it is. Yeah, um... This is not a fail, it's only a little char. It's not totally burnt, so I still don't consider this a fail. Okay. I put the top on the corn, so that way we can save it and everything will go cold. Sorry about the angles. So... Now we just gotta wait a few minutes for the other side to be done cooking and we can have our meal. But, I'm gonna get the, the plate ready, so...
Yeah. Move the plate over here. All the water that was in here is evaporated. <laughs> I wanted to keep it a little going, but I have to come back. I was watching Grace still so shit. So. I dyed my hair, you guys. I forgot to mention I dyed my hair. I straightened it and sprayed it with hairspray. <laughs> And I'm wearing my accessories. My profit accessories. Don't hate me because I'm beautiful. And if someone's like, no, you're gorgeous. I'm like, thank you. Let's be more realistic. When I say, when I say that, someone's gonna be like, no, you're fucking ugly. And I'm like, hello, darkness, my old friend. Sorry you guys, I'm just taking a little look. Um, I'm just trying to move it around so it doesn't get burnt. I mean, it's not totally burnt. And some people say when you cook chicken or fish, you want char. Um, and that's only a slight char, not totally burnt. So I'm just happy that worked out. Um, I need to practice more of my base cooking. Because lately, I'm getting a little rusty. Lately, I've been eating like frozen food. So I need to start cooking more like food food. But I will. And eventually, I want to move on to some harder, more detailed cooking, like sorbets and shit. That'd be fucking awesome. Uh, also, I want to do, try to cook beef wellington. And yet again, it sounds like an awesome thing to do. So yeah, I'm just going to put this back in the fridge. And clean up that little spot. Okay. So we got that. We have any more paper towels? No, we do not. Ah, I have to get that. Oh, here's one. Okay. Put these in the sink. And we're just gonna put soap on this. Okay, hold on. Alright, I'm gonna clean up this a little bit while the meat was. I don't wanna give no one salmonella. Alright, there we go. Alright, we're gonna take one more look at our chicken. It's not completely ready. Oh shit, yeah. We will I will cut here and come back in a few minutes. Yeah, it looks like it's starting to cook. I'm just doing a little check. This one looks like it's almost done, but this one's not cooking fast enough. Let me just take a little look. See? Yeah. Get that going. Let's try to... I don't know why I cut. I need a little look into this one just to see how cooked it is. All right, so this one is good. So we're gonna get our plate. Um, I unintentionally cut the damn thing in half. As you can see, I cut the damn thing in half by mistake. But, go. Okay, one chicken is done. Now we're just gonna check the other one, because if one's done, then the other one should be done, because I put them in at the same time. So let's just take a little look. Ah, damn it, that's hot. Take a little look. All right, it's done. Okay, so here's our chicken. 
hopefully I'm going to put a chicken. This is another five star chicken by the way. And this time, I don't have any potatoes to make mashed potatoes, so I'm using corn. Fun fact, my girlfriend stopped eating corn. I don't remember why, but she's a very picky eater. But then again, I was when I was younger. Anyone else do that phase where you didn't like your food touching? And you get those, uh, those, uh, fucking plates. Shit. The thing's hot. Anyway, has anyone ever been so picky with their food they don't want it touching, and they get one of those plates with the barriers around it? Because I used to do that a lot, and, I mean, I don't do it no more. That's literally what I used to do. Let's get our corn. So we have our corn. Um, I can literally hear my phone beeping because my girlfriend probably wants to talk to me. Um, ow, okay, ow, ow. okay, hold on. Ow. Okay. Ow. Damn it. I'll get me some tea, and we'll be ready for our feast. There we go, okay. It's still pretty yeah. messy. Put it there, I imagine now it'll tick. Perfect. That's gotta be it. You might be asking. Okay. Oh, oh shit. Alright, sorry about that. I was, uh, some stuff I had to look at. So, I literally came in here without my cup. I am so. After we get my wheels uh, on my van, I'll be doing a video of me driving my van. Now it doesn't have any tags or license plates so unfortunately I can't drive it like a normal car um, So, but I can drive it if I stay inside the trailer park. So I'm going to be testing out my skills on a short range spot to see how good I am because if I can do good at short range I most likely can do good on normal range. Um, so yeah. Literally, I'm watching Grace still plays. He's like the funniest guy ever. He plays video games. He has like a DJ5 and Happy Wheels. Yeah, my wheels are very happy. I was, I made my girlfriend laugh earlier while we were FaceTiming because I was like, babe, we don't need, we don't need sobriety where we're going. And she's like, oh yeah, I'm fine. She's also kind of pissed at me because she saw me smoking. <laughs> and I'm like, babe, I have to smoke. I have no weed. You better get used to being behind Bob. No way out. It's a sad, lonely, depressing life of solitude for you, boy. I wouldn't be so sure about that. Your old dad is a pretty ingenuitive guy. I've watched plenty of movies, so I know this cake is not just a cake. We reach inside of here. Let's see. I can show something. Yeah, I think my girlfriend thinks I'm weird. Of course, we have to ruin our five-star dining experience by getting a plate and putting ketchup on it. <laughs> because everyone knows that every five-star restaurant does not have ketchup. They have ketchup made from the fucking tomatoes of a sperm whale. It's very rare, but I don't have that. So, catch it from Dollar from the fucking Walmart. <laughs> we'll do. I'm not sure if that's actually true, but I just wanted to be funny. So, we got everything in the room. So, let's do this. There's my dog over there just chilling on the arm of the chair. Uh, okay. Spend your life in prison simulator 2018. For an accurate experience, that's exactly how it goes. I've seen enough prison movies. They always get cakes in prison, don't they? They're pulling out hacksaws and stuff out of there. Okay. Chainsaw isn't so far from it. So you guys oh, had a lot of shit. suggestions, but there's one suggestion that continues to be very prevalent. How much can you... There we go. Okay. So we have everything. And of course, we're going to taste it. This is the best dining experience. Welcome to John's Crappy Restaurant. Um, we don't have change, but we can give you an apple if you give us a 20. So, yeah. 
How about we just uh, take a little nibble of our food? So yeah, I don't like to eat, only nibble. Shit. All right, there we go. Okay, so we're just gonna move our lovely ketchup over here and have us some chicken. Like I said, it's a little charred, but it's not, it's not uh, dry and it should be delicious and it's fully cooked, so. Trying to ah shit my knife. <laughs> no, and I can't reach it. Fuck. There we go. I'm trying so hard not to move the camera, which is why I have to break this up with my hands because I don't want the camera to fall. There. We have our ketchup. Oh, I'm sorry, our murdered tomatoes from the back of the sperm whale. Mmm. Mmm. That's good. Okay. So, now we're going to try our corn. Mmm. That's good. Well done. Mm. So... I hope you guys like this video. Remember to like and subscribe to my channel. Follow me and everything. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my videos and links in the description for my last one. Thank you guys for watching. Goodbye.